finally found a U-Haul location with a U-Box. Definitely a calm 2K. 2K is crazy though, just so we know. 2K is crazy. 2K is crazy. I am in a U-Haul. I am going to my storage unit to go get all my stuff. I'm very greasy. I'm going to the storage unit to go get all my stuff and then I am going home to go get the rest of my stuff. I'm excited. This is a lot though. This is a lot. Superwoman, I'm Superwoman. Who's Superwoman? I'm Superwoman. Yeah. shipping container so we're gonna fit all of this in that tiny little box and whatever doesn't fit that fell while I was driving whatever doesn't fit is um, going back in the house this is not even supposed to be here I forgot about that so this is how we're doing it finished um this was an experience i'll probably never do this again um my back hurts okay so i look really rough we're gonna disregard i genuinely feel like because i'm so happy and i'm so excited that things are just not working right all of a sudden um work is becoming very unbearable that's that's number one number two here is that all of a sudden my AC is not working. It was working just fine. I was doing stuff. I was in the car. Worked in the car. Got out of the car. Everything was fine. Everything was fine. And I said, okay, I feel confident now. Like when I leave tomorrow night, which is tonight, like I'll be good. Now my AC is not working. Something is determined to like hold me back. Something is determined to like keep me discouraged. And honestly, I just have to say that I'm not. I just feel like, okay, all right. I'm ready to see how good it can get. And life is just like, <laughs> it's like, 
and um not gonna lie feels pretty bad but i'm not gonna let it get me down i'm not this is just an attack from the enemy there's no reason why my ac is not working right now 14 hours with no ac okay <laughs> and they fixed it. they fixed my ac so basically um, they thought it was the relay or something else i want to say a converter or something they're all like right next to each other what they did was they cleaned out my fans in my car and my ac started working perfectly so i can only imagine how close that was but anyway we got ac so we back in business yeah. i'm going to bed in like an hour 2 a.m i'm out of here 2 33 o'clock the latest but i'm out of here Y'all, it's happening. All right, I'm done. I'm about to get on the road. It is. Oh, anyway, it's like 2 40. And I'm about to get on the road. Um, let's do it. Okay, so it's 3 01, and I'm in the car, just warming up the car. My mom actually decided to come. So she's coming. <laughs> I kind of just set it up to um to just be me. <laughs> and um I am just moving stuff around in here so that she can be more comfortable because she's way taller than I am. First stop, getting some gas. And my mom's still in the car, but not me. I'm about to stretch because woo. That was only three hours. We're in Pennsylvania. We are on our way to, I think it's Roanoke Rapids now, Virginia. Um, got a ways to go. But we're like 250 miles down out of like a 900 mile trip. So that's not, that's not so bad. Not so bad. And it is 7, 18 a.m. We left at like 3.45. That's not, that's not so bad. I think we're doing pretty great about not living in New York is the fact that you don't have to hold this all day long. So, it's that. It's not so bad. It's not so bad. It could be worse. So I'm leaving Loves right now. We just got some Wendy's and I went back inside to go get some water and some Reese's Pieces and a Sprite. Getting a phone call. Ooh, it's my way. All right, y'all, so we made it to Chick-fil-A for our break time and lunch time. <laughs> this is my favorite place. We must, we shall. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Hannah. Happy birthday to you. Woo! So excited. My mom is driving and also pumping the gas. She said, I'll have to pump the gas too. I'm like, the driver's gotta do what the driver's gotta do. <laughs> I'm done. We drove mad hours from home after 3.45. And then I took a break in, what was it? Cumberland? Cumberland, Pennsylvania. Went to Wendy's didn't really eat the Wendy's. I drank the orange juice though because that's what I wanted. And then we drove six hours. I drove six hours straight. And then we drove to this gas station. I think it's across the state line. I'm feeling good about the road trip. This traffic has been great. The weather has been perfect. And like, my mom's a good road trip partner. She's not like a fan of road trips, but like she's a good partner. So having a good time and now i get to rest thank god ma how much is the gas 25 the gallon 10, 10, ma wow. per gallon oh. <laughs> this more than the last oh i had a quarter tank okay go ahead you can put more it's stopping all right well stop it at 47 I guess that's good. That's good. 
Hey, Glam. <laughs> Don't cover it so I can't see it. She's making me laugh. Quantos, Glam? Quantos? How much? I'm just happy to be in the passenger seat. If you know me, I'm a passenger. I can drive, but like, I really, this is just my, this is where I live. Made it back, giving her a tour. Then we're gonna go pick up the U-Haul to go get my couch and then the U-Box and then bringing everything back here. She keeps videoing everything and then sending it to everyone like, yeah, y'all, yeah. <laughs> we're unpacking and we're unloading and we're unboxing. I'm about to use a great deal of my energy. The couch needs to get picked up first, so. I'm just gonna get that done um, so that my friends can come over and help. All right, so we're here to pick up my truck. Pick up my truck. We're here to pick up my couch. I'm done talking. <laughs> here to pick up my couch. <laughs> and um, hopefully I can get in and out. That's ideal, we'll see. <laughs> Doing big girl things, know what I'm saying, okay? It's a very weird, um, feeling but it's also very freeing like I feel I feel good I feel happy this is so cool being an adult when you got the money thank you getting my couch y'all don't let up just do how easy they make it look yeah cuz I'm sure it, it ain't is gonna be that easy on the other end I'm very, just y'all too yeah college kids can always be persuaded with fear <laughs> <laughs> oh, snap. Thank you. I'm gonna go over here to pick up my couch. All right now. Oh, yeah, that stuff. Yeah, they will charge for that if you leave it. They sure will. Thank you. Oh, now that's thinking there, Jesus. You see that? Thank you so much. Thanks again. All right, y'all. I got my U box, so that's all that matters. We here. U box. U haul is giving me a really hard time, though. Not this guy. He's wonderful. It's a different location. Giving me a really hard time. He's wonderful. Literally a godsend. <laughs> I will say with me, but technically I live with her. Oh, you left her. One. Where's the other one? Here we go. Woo! I had to take the locks off. Oh my gosh. We made it. <laughs> Yay. <laughs> Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I like the one. <laughs> <laughs> oh, one couch down, one couch 
So this is the first half of the couch that we all put together. And do you guys want to be in the camera? Yeah, I'm sure. This is the next half of the couch that we are putting together. We're putting on the couch feet. And it couch sounds feet. and it sounds like heels. I'm gonna put it there. <laughs> this is what the couch is giving. Almost there. This is my TV. My mirror's over here. I did a good job wrapping that up. Oh, and this is the TV now. But I gotta call the guy to come in and do it. So we moved in, y'all. Say hey, mom. Mommy did all the the organizing of everything. She's just wonderful. That's my table. That's TV box. Ottoman. My lighting equipment. And yeah, this is like it's happened. It has happened. Let me see what else my mom did. Here's my bedroom. And my mom put this in here. My mom did all of this. She just put everything where it needed to go. And I'm just so grateful. I'm so tired. And then look, she even put this in here. That's love. Those are my coats. And then this is all my clothes and my shoes. This is lit, y'all. It's happened. This is so surreal, though, at the same time. Give me one more couch feet. One more couch feet. <laughs> <laughs> this is so crazy. <laughs> I'm just destabilizing here. We all finished. Amen. Church feet. Now put it down so we can hear it clap. Could you hear it clap, clap? Yeah. <laughs> together it's my day off i just organized my laundry room i just put all my seasonings away i've been living on my own now for 22 days almost been a month can you believe it that went by really fast um i've 
done shopping for my apartment. And honestly, I've been having a blast. Being able to do this now, it just feels so peaceful, so rewarding, like so right. Oh, here's my blender. It's a neutral bullet blender. It comes with like two cups. Where's the other cup? Comes with like two cups. One, one of them has a handle. needs to go at this point. <clears throat> I do find myself getting a little bit bored, just a little bit. But I feel like that's what it's me. It's like, I'll really just be chilling. Like, I just work and laugh and chill. Yeah, I'm not gonna be the girl that has the blender set up. Install my moon darkening curtain rod with me. I found this curtain rod on sale from Target. It was like $40. So I got it. Um, but I wanted to pretty much cover this whole area right here, right here. So I did little X's. So you can see them. Well, that's the hole. But I did little X's and, and stuff on the um, on the wall where I want the curtain to go, how far I want it to go. I'm already tired though. I don't know. Short people are not supposed to do this. It looks like no one's able to help, so I'm gonna do it myself. Wish me luck. Pencil keeps breaking. Do I take my one screw and put it at the top like I'm convinced? Oh, 
Yo, is it even? I think it's even. Be sure to follow me on all social media platforms at P-H-Y underscore L-I-S-H-A.